So welcome everyone. I'm Brendan Wallace, the co-founder of Fifth Wall, and today we're going to be introducing Jeremy Fox, our newest team member. So Jeremy, welcome. It's a pleasure to be here. Thank you for having me. So Jeremy, can you start maybe by, by just giving people a bit of your background and how you got to Fifth Wall? I spent most of my career in investment banking. My most recent job was at Credit Suisse, where I was co-head of the U.S. Real Estate Gaming and Lodging Investment Banking Group. Um, I'm excited uh, to join Fifth Wall uh, because uh, clearly, um, you know, a lot of the things that uh, I've been working on in banking at Credit Suisse and before, uh, I think are highly relevant. And I see Fifth Wall as sort of the next stage in the evolution of my career for a lot of reasons, which we'll get into later. Uh, my role at Fifth Wall is going to be to head up capital markets and also uh, our corporate relationships, which are obviously a very integral part of the business model and one of the things that has attracted me to Fifth Wall. And I'm super excited to get involved. So let's rewind a little bit and tell people about you. How did you get to the seat you were just in and you know, even before coming to Fifth Wall? Just walk us through your life story. I'll give you the, uh, the, 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 the quick version. I was an accounting major in college. I went to work at Ernst & Young. I liked real estate, so I worked in the real estate group. Um, in the late 90s, Wall Street was going crazy with the dot-com boom. I saw an opportunity to leave accounting, which frankly I didn't really like anyway, and moved to Wall Street. Um, I was able to get a job in Goldman Sachs in sales and trading. Um, and I worked in sales and trading and then switched over to Deutsche Bank, where I focused within sales and trading as an equity sector salesman focused on real estate, gaming and lodging. I got to know a lot of the real estate investors. I got to know a lot of the corporates. Um, and then as a result of some changes on Wall Street um, around the research settlement and just the engagement um, in the uh, in the banking process, uh, it made sense for me to move to equity capital markets. So in 2005, I moved over to equity capital markets. Um, I started in syndicate. The plan was for me to always focus on um, origination for real estate, gaming, and lodging. Um, you know, I would say at the beginning, there wasn't a lot of activity in real estate, gaming, and lodging. So we were doing a lot of things like SPACs and uh, mortgage REITs and other forms of, uh, of specialty finance companies. And then, um, you know, we had the whole uh, financial crisis, which almost took down the REIT market and, and Deutsche Bank. And my team uh, were very front and center uh, in the recap of the uh, of the entire REIT sector. We did the first deal, which was the Simon Property Group. We did deals for Prologis, for Host, um, you know, Equity Residential. Um, you know, we were involved in in in, in most of the high profile transactions. Um, I think there were over a hundred of them. Uh, and so, you know, that was that was obviously uh, an important uh, time in my career because it, it, you know, was 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 critical for the industry, but also was really helpful for me in raising my profile for building relationships with uh, the, the corporate CEOs and for cementing the relationships that I had um, built over the years with the investors. And then post the crisis, we started to see a lot more activity. Uh, and Deutsche Bank uh, and my team were at the center of a lot of it. We were the lead underwriter on the GGP IPO. We were the lead underwriter on Starwood Property Trust, Invitation Homes, Hilton. Uh, fast forward to 2019, um, there was an opportunity for me to leave capital markets and uh, join Credit Suisse as head of real estate, gaming and lodging investment banking. So I did that. Um, I thought I was going to have a long career there. Um, it's a great platform. I had a great team. Um, and we had a lot of momentum. And then, of course, the opportunity to come to Fifth Wall presented itself. And uh, I decided that it was way too compelling of an opportunity to pass up. Now that you've all had a chance to meet Jeremy and hear, I think, how Fifth Wall can support large real estate organizations as they look to more proactively engage with technology, um, the best way to get in touch with us is reach out to Jeremy, reach out to me, we're easy to find, or go to our website at fifthwall.com.